All right, we're on one hull, and we made it to the fifth system. We unlocked a new ship, so if we die, at least we can try out uh, something new. There's only one place for us to go. Pretty bad luck. Usually there's a store here. This is the civilian sector, so hopefully we'll be in luck. But we have to visit at least one location before we find a store. And this only goes to one place. But then this goes to, like, five other places. So if that's not a store, it's got to be next to a store at least. But we only have one house, so we're in serious uh, trouble here. Now, you know what? Actually, let me see if I can upgrade our shields so maybe we can uh, get by better. You know, I can get to three barriers, but I'm not sure if I can upgrade the power enough. Now, it looks like we're good. Yeah, this is the, it's the extra power upgrade in the last system to get to uh, some of the, uh, the plasma storms there. So, uh, yeah, we're actually good with uh, three shield levels now. I don't know if it'll be enough. We'll uh, find out. <laughs> you detect an automated rebel scout attacking a small refueling outpost. Oh man, maybe we shouldn't intervene. I think we're gonna have to avoid the conflict. I hate to do it, but we just have no hull. You steer clear of the conflict. The outpost receives a beating, but the ship stops its attack before it's destroyed. All right, we have Distress Beacon here, so we're gonna have to fight something, I'm sure. You find the source of the Distress Call, a small research station. It appears a small laboratory fire got out of control and it's threatening to destroy the station. Their fire suppression system is not responding. Oh, we can send our repair drone into the fire. Yeah, that sounds a lot better. You send the repair drone in, and it methodically puts out the fires. Once it has made some progress, the rest of your crew helps secure the station. Contact the survivors. They offer you their sincere gratitude, and the station would have been surely destroyed without your assistance. They transfer a small reward and additional drone schematic. Man, we got so many drones. <laughs> Anti-ship beam drone one and 57 scrap. Wow. I hope we have a, a shot. Oh, here's a store. It was close to the rebels. Oh, what the hell? We need a store. You find yourself surrounded by a group of mysterious alien vessels. They hail you and apparently have some valuable technology for sale. Alright, this protects our ship from ion damage, giving a 50% chance to negate it entirely. Oh, this is that repair arm. I'm gonna get mind control, a clone bay, ooh, a crew teleporter. That sounds like a good idea. Ooh, we get a Mantis crew member. He's good with weapons and crew damage. Hmm. Too bad we can't sell our own crew. <laughs> I think we're a full-on crew right now. There is an achievement uh, for getting one of every type of crew on this ship. I don't know how uh, easy it is to do, but let's sell some of these uh, drones. I think we just looked out. We only had four cargo slots, so if we got more free stuff, we wouldn't have been able to do anything with it. Hmm. We got two of these anti-drones, so they must be pretty common. We don't need the uh, backup DNA bank. That uh, only sells for 20. The boarding drone sounds good. You know what? Let's buy the uh, the teleporter. Then we can send the, the boarding drone on board. Or we can get that Mantis crewman. Ooh. Oh, they do 1.5 times the damage in combat, and he already has some combat experience. <sighs> yeah. Oh, man. That's a toughie. Uh, hmm. Can we buy both? Oh, why not both? Yes, we can. <laughs> All right. Although, uh, I think we should sell something. Yeah, let's sell this defense drone, because we need a repair. <laughs> That's kind of the important thing. <laughs> a current hull one. You know what, can we sell anything else? I don't want to sell the boarding drone, but, I mean, we'll probably find another. Yeah, it'll be fine.
I'm not really using them right now, so what's the point of keeping them? I think I want to get this repair arm. Yeah, let's get it. That'll repair us when we're not near our shop, too. And uh, hopefully this will be enough hull <laughs> for now. <laughs> I might be making a huge mistake here, but uh, we'll see. Let's see. This guy will be in the teleporter room, where the heck that is. Here we go. Make sure all these doors are closed. Save positions. Alright, I think we're good. And uh, can we see the sensor? Yeah, we can see the enemy interior. Excellent. Let's jump over here. We're pretty close to the rebel fleet, it's kind of scary. <laughs> You stumble across a Ford Scout with a Rebel fleet. God damn it. They are powering up their FTL. If they get away, they will no doubt warn the fleet of your position. Alright, they got like a combat drill in there too. Um, hmm. Yeah, I think we're better off trying to take out their shields and weapon systems. And hoping they don't breach our hull because our hull is low. We do have these new more powerful shields. So hopefully they don't have any kind of hard counter to shields. Obviously, we don't want them to power up their FDL and get away either. Alright, we were damaged the weapon systems. Hopefully, that helps a little bit. Oh, they're damaging our ship too, though. Our ship cannot take damage. I might have to jump out myself. Oh, we took the weapons offline. That's good. Alright, let's focus on their, their shields here, and I'm gonna beam uh, that crew member over. Yeah, let's send him here. Aw, oh, man. The other guy joined in. Uh-oh. Our crew member might die. I need to send him some help. I don't have anyone with any help, though. Aw, oh, she's weak, but... Oh, what the heck, I'll send her. Yeah. Oh, I can't. I can't send anything. I can't send him away or send anyone to him. So he's on his own. That guy's pretty weak. He might be able to take him. Nah, he's done for. Oh well. That was a waste of money. Oh, and they escaped! Uh oh. The scout jumps away. They're sure to have informed the fleet of your position. You must get to the next sector as soon as possible. Alright, I need a, I need another weapon or something. I'm not doing enough damage. Well, I did have the idea to board, but uh, I just lost my my uh, attack error there. And I sold the boarding drone, so uh, the teleporter might not be getting much use now. <laughs> I should have sent more than one guy, or I should have waited before I sent the crew. It would have been bad if they teleported with the Mantis guy, too. Then it would have been lost as well, probably. Oh, well, there's nothing I can do about that. Oh, wow, the Rebel fleet is really close. Might have to just get out of the system as soon as I can. Low on fuel, too. This beacon has been placed too close to the Supergiant Class M star. The ship will gradually overheat until you get out of here, or die. A pirate, apparently oblivious to the danger of the sun, moves in to engage. Oh man, solar flares will light the ship on fire. Shields will reduce the effect. Oh, good thing I've got shields. Oh, he's got fancy shields, though. Oh man. I'm feeling very outclassed by these ships. Our defenses are okay, but our uh, weaponry is not cutting it anymore. Whew, did not pierce our shields. Whoa, that missile missed. If we can take out his shields, then, oh yeah, maybe we'll uh, get him with a solar flare. We'll just focus on his shields. Alright, you win. Here's some equipment from our stores. Leave us alone. You know what? We're not going to accept surrender, because I think I'm about to break their shields, and the solar flare will hit them. Oh yeah, they're on fire. Oh shoot, we got some fire too. They got hit hard though. Oh yeah, they're in trouble. 
And they're dead. Aw, oh, their missile hit us. The missile hurt. Ship explodes, leaving behind a substantial collection of useful scrap material. That's good, we got the repair arm at least, so our hull will uh, get repaired a little bit from that scrap. Yep, see it already did. It's not too much, 15%, but it's way better than nothing. Let's let this guy uh, repair that hull breach first. <laughs> Excellent. Alright, where, uh, ooh, should we go to the nebula maybe? That'll slow them down a little bit. Although, we're kind of far from the exit. I think we should just head towards the exit. By the time you notice the rebel ship behind the beacon, it's too late to avoid a fight. Man, civilian sector is full of rebels. I'm starting to think the Federation might not be the good guys if all the civilians are riding. <laughs> All right. Oh man, they all have really good shields. I guess we'll focus on trying to get the shields down first. They have some kind of anti, uh, anti type of drone too. Ah, oh, see, like I can handle their other weapons, but those missiles go straight through my shields. Oh, come on, do some damage to their shields. Oh, I think our shield guy just gained a level. Sweet. 30% faster shield recharge. Whoa, look at all those missiles flying by. Oh, we are just not breaking their shields. I think we gotta jump. I hate to do it. This is just not working out. Let's head out to the store. Maybe it'll have something useful for us. A ship engineer set up a small shop here. All right, it's just all drones. That's all I see is drones in these stores. Mind control, backup battery, cloaking. Hmm. Cloaking is really expensive though. Jose, a rock man. Scrap recovery arm, 10% more scrap from any source. Ooh, that sounds really good. Although I think we're kind of late in the game. It might be too late to get this. Weapon pre-igniter, weapons are made immediately available after an FTL jump. That sounds really good. Oh my god, recharge booster. FTL drive powers up 25% faster. Oh, why are these all so awesome? All right, what, what do we have to sell? Uh, it's like nothing. Man, we might as well just fix as much as we can out of their ship and move on. Oh, I should buy some more fuel too. Alright, that will have to do. It's a rough sector. Hopefully we'll find something easier on the way to the, uh, the exit. Because I'm sure it's only going to get uh, tougher. You receive a request. All of our military ships have been destroyed or damaged in the rebellion. However, there have been reports of a Mantis war camp only a few jumps from us. Can you help? Hmm. Maybe. I don't know. The rebel uh, fleet might beat me there. I guess it doesn't hurt to promise, though. So. Alright, if you can give us a count on their numbers, perhaps we can get the rebels to help. Alright, 45 scrap. Good deal. Repaired our ship a little bit. Oh, here's a distress call right here. It's only one jump away. They lied. Oh, and it goes back to the exit. Hopefully the rebel fleet doesn't get to the exit. Otherwise, we'll be in some serious trouble. You arrive at the beacon and merely, immediately detect a pirate ship. It seems as this uh, distress beacon was a trap. Oh, shoot. Was that a distress beacon and not the quest beacon? Oh, I feel kind of dumb. All right, they're gonna be teleporting guys over. So uh, let's try and get people in these uh, these rooms together here. Oh, they actually went to the, the cockpit. Shield's so good. My weapons must just suck. 
What was that noise? Oh, intruder just detected. Okay, duh. Man, these NG guys are bad fighters, I guess. Is that one, one of their stats? Man. Ah, not the cockpit. Cockpit's like the worst place, and it's only too big. I need a ship with a bigger cockpit to better defend against these guys. You know, I hate to jump away from a fight. Let's see if we breach their shields with the next attack. Oh, they actually teleported back. Alright, that might be a good thing. It's probably a bad thing, but it might be a good thing. Alright, their shields are down. Let's take out their teleporter. Everyone return to stations. All right, we made the point. Uh, they're beaten. Take these and leave us to our shame. You know what? We just blew up their sh shields, teleporter, and they are on fire. I say we keep up the attack. Oh crap! They did teleport over. How they teleport over? The teleport is destroyed. Oh, it must have gotten blown up a second before they came over. Oh, that's so annoying. All right, we took him out. Finally, a uh, victory. Jeez, it's been a rough sector for a civilian sector. Oh, go there. All right, we should be able to take out this last guy easily. I don't know why they focus on the rock man who's got the most freaking health. Not the uh, the smartest uh, crew. <laughs> Jeez, this sector sucks. Alright. Oh, it's like right on the edge of the rebel fleet. We probably have to fight them. Um, can we do any upgrades here? It's too bad we can't use our teleporter to teleport away their guys. Oh well. Uh, hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. I don't see their weapon charge isn't that useful, I don't think. Can't do anything about shields. Engine, we can make engines better. Yeah, let's uh, improve our engines. Give us some more evasion. Whew, we made it there before the rebel fleet. You come across a large trade station. However, as soon as you approach, a warning goes out to all ships in the region. Do not associate with the Federation Sympathizer. All who oppose the rebels will be punished. Search among the stores to see if someone will sell to you. Sure. You search for a friendly marketplace, yields no results. But after a time, a small shuttle approaches. They release some supplies in your direction with a message. We are not all friends of the rebel fleet. Stay strong. Score. A fuel, two missiles, and 58 scrap. All right, on to the next uh, next sector. Man, we barely survived this one. This one was rough. <laughs> All right, tune into the uh, the next episode.